the next 60 minutes, y'all. I'm going to lead you through the time under tension workout today. This was the top rated strength workout of the year, okay? So when you think time under tension, it's going to relate most to the weight floor. You're going to see some slower tempoed exercises today. Everything in moderation, you guys. Any orthopedic issues, exercise restrictions, make sure you let me know ahead of time. When we get in there for our treadmills, we're working on builds. So we're going to have increasing times as we work through those first three. We'll flip it around and get shorter in that second half. But we want to try and maintain consistency on those speeds, regardless if they're 30 seconds, 60 seconds, whatever. Okay? Rower, short, powerful. When we get there, make sure you got those feet strapped in tight. This one's get you through the door. We've got 60 minutes of fun, South Water Town. Let's get it done. Your video. Oh, here's the first one. Okay. Get that energy up. We got it. Yes. Go for it. Go for it. Go for it. Process is in order. All right. I think I should Oh, we'll get you a station. All right, Michelle. Those of you coming into the rower side, grab a seat before you take a seat up on the treadmill. Let's get locked into that OT Connect screen. You've got to highlight your name, press that orange go button. The green star button by your waist bar is going to turn that treadmill on, and it should get itself to 1% incline. If it's not there, please tap the left hand side. Your speed coming up three to four miles an hour. Let's lock it out nice and easy breezy. Those of you on the rower, I see some of you already getting logged in, highlighting your name, pressing that orange go button. We are adjusting foot plates, getting that strap over the widest portion of your shoe. We're going to start with that setup. Sit up tall. Get those shoulders down and back. Grab that handle at the widest part, shoulder width. Take that drive out of the legs to get that water rolling. Let's lean and pull that handle, shoulder blade squeeze together. All right, we reach forward, lean forward, keep it moving, treads. We're looking for base pace. We're going to get it up. Power walkers increasing intensity on that incline, one to three percent. Speed from a three and a half to four and a half miles an hour. Our joggers hold that one percent flat row, four and a half to five and a half on your speed. And our runners are five and a half or greater. This should feel challenging, but doable crew. We're chasing after some green. In three, two, one, base. Row team, driving a little bit firmer with those legs. You want to increase wattage. You're also trying to get into that green zone. Feeling challenging, but doable. That posture's looking great. Couple minutes to warm up here. Again, those on the treads. We're going to see some builds coming up. Your base is going to be a key factor in them. After each build, we will return to your base base, building some endurance. Right here, I want you to find that flex deck. Relax the upper body. Start mobilizing the arms front to back, pockets to chin. that reverse slide. 
hip hinge with those feet hip width apart. All right, those booties back. Soft bend the elbow, big squeeze of the shoulder blades together as you drive up. You're gonna work through this. You've got two rounds before you go over to that rower. Now you're focused on that 200 meter row. Looking at that time, I recommend using the story program so we can see exactly when you finish strong. You're gonna do two rounds over there. Rack those handles, rest in between. All right, y'all flag me down if you need other options. I'll be back to check in. About 15 seconds till the treads fly. You're gonna start in that first build. 30 second intervals. As we go up, again, we're not going all the way to that all out, we'll go back to base. Our walkers start at 8% or greater. Let's kick it up in three, two, one. We've got 30 seconds in our base to push. 